While the COVID pandemic brought new attention to the importance of indoor air quality in schools and universities, it has been known for years that student performance and attendance can be impacted by IAQ conditions. The U.S. Environmental Protection Agency reports that programs that promote healthy indoor air quality can improve health, increase students' ability to learn, improve test scores, and improve adult productivity in the school system. In response to COVID, many schools increased ventilation rates and invested in air purification and filtration systems to mitigate the spread of the coronavirus. These actions can also help to decrease carbon dioxide levels and student and faculty exposure to other gases and airborne viruses, bacteria and mold, and a wide variety of allergens and respiratory irritants. Controlling moisture and dampness in a school building is another area of importance as it can lead to the growth of mold and various respiratory issues. In fact, the EPA warns that failing to prevent or respond promptly to IEQ problems can increase long and short-term health effects for students and staff, such as coughing, eye irritation, headaches, allergic reactions, aggravated asthma and or respiratory illnesses, and, in rare cases, contribute to life-threatening conditions such as Legionnaire's disease or carbon monoxide poisoning. Maintaining a comfortable temperature and managing humidity levels is also important for comfort and creating conditions conducive for learning. These are just a few of the many things to know about indoor air quality and student performance. To learn more about this or other IAQ, industrial hygiene, HVAC, environmental health, or safety issues, please visit the website shown on the screen. IAQ TV, the place to be.